Hi everyone, it's Amy again, and today I have a really special package from Coco Daisy. So as of today, well as of yesterday, you guys would have found out that I have joined the Coco Daisy planner team alongside Florence, I love Florence, my bestie Sam, and th that's Happy Scrappy, and Candy, which is, uh, who is, follow iCandy. So I'm so honored and lucky to be a part of this team. I'm so excited to get started and to share how I use their kits with my planners and hopefully you guys can gain some inspiration from my type of style when it comes to creative planning. So this is the first package that I've received from them. I've kind of just sharpied out the addresses because it's too much effort taping my business card to it and having to take it off again. <laughs> Anyways, um, so this is the package and this is how it came to me. I've only... Um, just use my little box cutter to open the box. I haven't actually opened the box and looked inside yet. But I do want to show you guys this. Look at this cute little bunny stamp. How cool is he? It says thank you and he has really cute nerdy glasses and this little, this little shirt with the pocket full of pens. This is so cute. That must be a custom stamp. It is adorable. So let's open this up and share with you guys what is in this kit. Oh my gosh, look at how pretty. Okay, I know I've talked about how I end up accidentally hitting the tripod every now and then. And some of you guys are telling me, oh, um, put the tripod in front of you and just film upside down and then you can just flip the video when you start editing. But the problem is I can't do that because my desk, the reason why I have all this nice natural lighting is because my desk is directly in front of the window. So right in front of me is a window. <laughs> it's completely pushed up against the window so I have no room in front of this desk to place the tripod and film upside down. I hope that makes sense. But it was a great idea, but I just can't do it with the way that my office is set up. So let's open this up and grab these little goodies. Oh my gosh, so cute. So it says, hello and thank you. This packaging is totally awesome. And then there's a little, I think these are called crystalline bags. I'm not, but I'm not exactly sure. There's a little daisy sticker. So cute. And there's an acrylic stamp that says to-do list. So in order to use this, you would need an acrylic block. And do I have one here? I do. This is just a mini one that I got from Joann's. It's part of their little dollar spot that they have. So you would need one of these acrylic blocks and you'd have to peel one of the layers off and then stick it on top of the acrylic block to use with a stamp. Well, an ink pad in order to stamp. So that's really cute. Love that. That's going to come in handy. So let's grab this. Oh my god, there's two. Ah, there's two packages in here. So let's get these little shavings out of the way. Place that here and grab the other one. So this box is pretty big and it's picking up all the room. Okay, so that's the second one. Let's move this box out of the way. Okay, so seriously, the packaging, oh my god, it's so beautiful. Oops, I missed one. So there's cute little Coco Daisy stickers, and look at this. Someone stamped each bag and says, enjoy every day. It is so cute. Okay, so this is the Coco Daisy Daisy Day Planner Kit. It says, making your daily schedule a little brighter. Oh my gosh, this packaging is amazing. Now I don't want to tear because I like to reuse these things. I can stick it in my planner to document that my kit arrived today. That's something that I enjoy doing. Oh my God, you guys. Okay, this, oh my gosh. So, so beautiful. Everything is beautiful, okay. So in the first one, let's move this one out of the way. I'll open this one next. In the first paper bag is the May kit. So let's just move these out of the way too. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is so beautiful. Okay. Ah, I'm so excited, okay. Can you tell how excited I am? Oh my God, okay, so. Um, they have the personal option as well as the A5 option. I opted for the A5 option so that I can end up using one of my A5 planners because I'm mostly using my 
personal size planners or my life planner, my inkwell press planner. I wanted to utilize some of the A5 size planners that I have, so I asked for the A5 sized kit. So it comes with a divider with a tab to show the name of the month, which is amazing. It's 2015 May, and then it says right here, you can't always wait for the perfect time. Sometimes you have to dare to do it because life is too short to wonder what could have been. What a motivational quote, that is beautiful. Oh, sorry. And then on the back is a little calendar view of the month. Oh my gosh, these are amazing. Oh my God, I love these. Okay, so this is what the inserts look like. Ah, okay. So there's a weekly view type of insert like this. So each of the days are here, Sunday through Monday. And then on the back of this, it's like graph paper, but it's beautifully de uh, designed with this watercolor type of design in the corner. So it's graph paper, so you can use a section for notes. And then right here it says notes, writing is thinking on paper. And then now we have the weekly inserts. Oh my gosh, these designs are beautiful. So these are undated, which is awesome because if you end up not using this kit for this year, you can use it for next year. The only thing that will be different is um, is the monthly calendar view. The days will just be shifted a little bit if you end up using it for a different year. But the inserts themselves are undated, so you can write in the number of the week or the week dates right here. Like if it was May 1st to May 7th, then you could write that here. You could use stamps, you could use stickers, you could... Honestly, these are so customizable, which is what I really love about it. The lighting's getting a little funky. Um, so you, yeah, you can use whatever you'd like to number the dates. So those are what the weekly inserts look like. And then there should be enough for that month. And then there are the notes section again. Now look at the back of this. <laughs> How cute! Aren't the pencils so cute? They're beautiful, you guys. So it comes with note paper. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. And then this is what I wanted to show you guys. Look at these beautiful daily to-do sheets. Can you see this? Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, so again, you can write in the date, you can stamp in the date with a ruler stamp, whatever you'd like. Right here it says 15 minute pickup, dinner, notes and ideas, before bed, what I'm thankful for, purchases that I've made. Oh God, that's gonna be a bad section for me because I'm a shopaholic. Um, must do, call, to-do list, a hydrate section, and there's even a coffee cup. I'm addicted to coffee, so. That's very, very useful. Look at this. There, it's, it's already automatically checked. Schedule, but first, coffee. <laughs> Isn't that so cute? I mean, that's going to be so very true for me. I cannot function without coffee. Oh my gosh, you guys. These are just so, so beautiful. And look at how many they come with. I am just flipping, flipping, flipping through. So many. Okay, so those are what the inserts look like. I'm just going to put that right up here so it's out of the way. And then it also comes with this May set of label stickers. Beautiful. Oh my gosh. Tab divider stickers, circles. Look at these cute little designs. Study break, which is great because I'll most likely be using my kit for school. Aren't they just... Oh look, the little bunny again. Isn't he so cute? These stickers are beautiful. And then the rubber stamps, oh, well, the acrylic stamps, I should say, the clear, oh my God, yes, I have the bunny. Oh my gosh, yes, I'm so excited. Okay, so this stamp kit comes with, it's limited edition for each month, you know, and it comes with the little bunny that was stamped on my package and I'm so excited for it. Cause I was like, this must be a custom stamp. It's so cute and I got it. Oh my God, okay, I'm so excited now. So aren't these just so beautifully designed? I love the little pen and pencil, great for school. That's limited edition. Man, there's so much more, you guys. Ah. There are also some journaling cards that you can use. Here are some of them. The boys are at home, so they're gonna end up making a lot of noise. And I apologize for that. 
I'm I can always find a way to use these journaling cards. Look at the glitter. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Beautiful. Like that. It also comes with a notepad of the pencils and pens, which I love because I just oh this is just so perfect for my school planner because that's probably what I'm gonna end up using this kit for. Yes, I know there's an app for this, <laughs> but hey, pen and paper, the old traditional way is the way to go. I know everything is so digitalized and technological nowadays, but I prefer the old fashioned way. And then there's also some, a little pack of ephemera, so little cutouts that you can use. I'm not gonna individually show this because I don't want the video to end up being too long. So you can just, kind of see there's little little cut out pictures and phrases that you can use to decorate <laughs> this cute little pouch with the little geo stamp and a heart and then there are paper clips oh my gosh you guys this is just amazing seriously little telephone paper clips oh my god yes the bunny Planner Nerd, a little charm that you can attach to your planner, which I'm going to do. And also, a roll of washi tape. How cute. It says, dare to dream, today is your day, love, life, always, you make me happy. A whole bunch of really great phrases. Okay, so now let's open the second one. After I neatly put these back. <laughs> All right. So here's the second one. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I was sent two kits, <laughs> which I was not expecting. So that's why there are two of them. I should have done this one first. This one is the April kit. So it's a little backwards because I showed you the May kit first. But this is the April kit. And I'm going to use it to the best of my ability because April is almost over. But if I don't, I will just, like I said, I will use it at a different month or I mean, a different month of a different year. This will be a little shifted, but that's okay. So that was a full May kit. And then this April kit comes with this stamp set, which is also limited edition. Oh my God, and it has to, it's like coffee themed, <laughs> which I love. So if not now, then when, a little ducky. But first coffee, perfect. Don't forget, today's happy notes. Another but first coffee stamp, ducks in a row, to do. And then now let's flip through these April inserts. Oh my gosh, these designs and illustrations are just so beautiful. So this is April of 2015. I like people who smile when it's raining and that is very rare to find. I rarely find someone who's smiling when it's raining. So that's the divider and with, again with the tab for the month, the monthly view. And then the weekly view, look at the color scheme. It's just so pretty. You can see the difference in the months. I love this color scheme too. And look, look at this watercolor design. Isn't that just so beautiful? So that's the um, graph paper for notes. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. Okay, look for the silver lining. And then... Oh, so beautiful. So you can set this up however way you want. So some of these have the... Uh, the weekly view and then some also have a, another little note section even though the front is like that oh wait no so that goes like that okay that makes more sense so it still goes like this flipping over notes oh my gosh so beautiful the weekly view and then look at this the daily to do for this month's kit isn't it so beautiful look at the color scheme so again Everything here is the same. The only difference is the color scheme and the little illustrations. Except this one doesn't have coffee. <laughs> so the May kit has the checked off but first coffee. And then you can fill in whatever you want for the rest of the day, which is perfect for me because I always start my day with coffee. But this one is different. So look, look at these cute little lemonade looking cups <laughs> with straws. So this is what April's inserts look like. And then flipping through. I believe that should be it. Oh, sorry about that. I'm pretty sure this is it. Yeah. So those are the inserts for the April kit. So 
So again, in just a little overview, this is what I received for the April kit, and this is what I received for the May kit. So those are little close-ups of what each kit looks like, depending on what you purchase and for what size planner you purchase. So I hope you enjoyed watching this overview video, and I hope that you guys will all look forward to how I create using these items. So look forward to Coco Daisy's blog, because that's where I'll be posting blog posts as well as my own blog. And my Instagram account will also have pictures of everything. So be sure to follow me on Instagram and continue subscribing to my YouTube channel if you already are a subscriber. If not, subscribe down below and you'll continue to see more videos from me. So thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful week. I love you all. Mwah. Bye.